Governor Godwin Obaseki has visited Osa Market, popularly known as Ekiosa Market, to ascertain the extent of destruction caused by the fire that raised the market. The governor, who was accompanied by some service commanders and members of the State Executive Council, alleged that the fire incident would have been caused by arsonists, who he accused of also stopping firefighters from getting to the scene of the incident to put out the fire. Governor Godwin Obaseki also inspected the EDPA building affected by the fire. He said, though he was worried about the disturbing spate of fire outbreaks in the States, he was not surprised about it, as it follows threats by detractors who had vowed to make the state ungovernable for him. Last week, now Olia, we don't know the one when they go do tomorrow. When I don't see where fire will burn something, someone can't, one can't help you, make you quench the fire. You go drive the person come out. This fire hole and see, not be accident. Yes. Now people not put them. Yes. They don't do their worst. Thank God. Nobody died. Now property loss. By the grace of God, we will replace the property. Today, this morning, I don't approve. Say me gonna give me the list of everybody when gonna know. Say they really trade for this market. I don't tell the woman leader for market. The president of the market uh, women association say me, uh, us as government, we go put today hundred million naira to compensate to now. Edo State Commission of Police Lawa Jamata said a thorough investigation of repeated cases of fire outbreaks in the state was on, promising to bring perpetrators to book if any is found. We are joining hands with the fire services because uh, it's their field for the, for the investigation. But I, what I promise is that a deep investigation is going on and anybody, and I repeat anybody, that has a hand in this will not be left, it will be arrested and prosecuted according to the laws. In the meantime, Edo State Government says the affected traders will conduct their business activities in a session of the market while others will move to Ugiso Market. This is to allow government clear debris from the bonds market for immediate reconstruction beginning from January next year. Deborah Ugbefon reporting.